ChatGPT has been blowing up lately, and this is how you can use it in your dropshipping business. Alright, so if you don't know about ChatGPT, you've been sleeping under a rock. So if you don't know, it's an AI tool where you ask questions and it answers. And there are a couple of ways that you can use it to make your life so much easier. So watch to the end so you can save hours of work. So we need to find a good product to sell, and currently, it's March. So let's ask, what are good products to sell in March? Now I don't really like these 5 answers, so we can tell it to write 5 more. Ok so these are a little better, and I like fitness equipment. So let's ask for good fitness products. So dumbbells and weights are gonna cost more than Jeff Bezos net worth to ship. So we're gonna go with resistance bands. So let's see if we can find some cool resistance band products on CJ Dropshipping. This resistance band set is pretty cool and it went super viral back in 2020. And since there are different variants, we can do a heavy and a light version. So let's ask for good domains. I really like flexbands.com, so you can go to lean domain search to check if it's available. <coughs> okay, it isn't, but we can just do my flex band instead. Then go to the link in the description to get $1 Shopify plan. Then connect the store to CJ Dropshipping. So we gotta enter a price. So let's ask ChatGPT. 50% markup isn't that much and also $41.78 is a weird price. So let's ask for a cleaner price. Let's go with $49.99. We gonna do the same for the heavy set. And $69.99 it is. This is a decent product title. So I'm not gonna make ChatGPT write all the legal pages at this speed. So let's use the copy and paste blueprint. We just add the basic ones. Now, I forgot the compare price. So let's ask ChatGPT for an offer people can't refuse. Okay, so 24.99 is an offer people can't refuse, but that only leaves us with $5 in profit, but we are just gonna keep the 50% off and with our own price. Okay, so now we gotta make the product page with gem pages. So we need a website color. Okay, I think we pick number 4 red. So let's make it a color code. This is the red we are gonna be using. Then we need a good headline. This is pretty basic, but it should work. Then we need 4 benefits in bullet points. So let's add the bullet points. Looks good. Now we want a 5 star review of the product. Okay, not an entire book. So make it shorter. This is pretty good actually. Add some stars and a name. Now we just add the variants, quantity, add to cart, and trust badge. This is our product page, pretty simple, but I think it's pretty good. So next we gotta make the home page. So first we gotta change the color to our store color. Here we need a short headline. This describes the product pretty well. Then we need a description underneath. Yeah, this is fine, perfect. Then we need some testimonials. Okay, so these reviews are a bit too long. Nobody's gonna read that. Make them shorter. Well, these are a bit too short. Let's try a bit longer. Looks fine. Then we need our 30-day guarantee. Yeah, this looks good. Let's make a quick logo as well. Then we gotta do the navigation. We also need to do the FAQ. Damn, this is so easy. Literally just copy and paste. This is our website, the home page, and the product page. Now we gotta move on to our email marketing. Here we of course gonna be using Klaviyo. So we need to make an abandoned cart email and an order confirmation. We need an abandoned cart email where customers get an extra 10% off if they check out now. This is pretty good, but way too long. So let's make it shorter. This is perfect. Now the email is gonna look like this. It's not the best in the world, but we are just gonna do whatever ChatGPT wants us to do. So we click save and enter the subject line. Now when the abandoned cart email is online, we make our customer order confirmation because the standard doesn't look that great in my opinion. So go to templates, click create template, and then Shopify notifications. Here you can see the standard Shopify emails and then customize them. Write an order confirmation email to a customer. This is fine, I guess. So let's just paste this into the email. All right, now this email is done. Then go back and click the dots and export. Then copy this and go to Shopify, then notifications and order confirmation. Now click edit code, select all by doing control A and then paste. This is better in my opinion. Now you can of course also use ChatGPT to write an abandoned cart SMS and this would actually be great but I'm not gonna set it up since it's almost the same as email. You can also use ChatGPT for writing SEO for your website so it ranks higher in Google search, but I don't know how to do that, so I might need ChatGPT to teach me about it. And if you don't know about SEO either, just pause the video here and read. 
Then you can also use ChatGPT for customer service. So if you get an email from a customer who hasn't received their product, just make ChatGPT write an apology email. This is actually pretty good. Or if a customer's item arrives broken, you can actually just copy and paste the complaint and tell ChatGPT to answer it. Now one of the most important things about dropshipping is marketing. And if you want to see me make some ads and test the website and product, please let me know in the comments. By the way, was the script for this video made with ChatGPT? I guess we'll never know.